What's up guys, Colton Lindsay here with Fearless Agent Live. And if you haven't noticed, I got a new haircut, so let's celebrate that. Now, if you guys are hopping on, make sure to drop that L as a live watcher or an R for a replayer. Thank you for being here so much. How would you like to be able to know how to stop wasting money on marketing? and start investing money in the right places inside of your business. Well, that's what we're gonna to cover today inside of the Fearless Agent Live, right here, live in the Fearless Agent Facebook group. Now, I want you to scroll down, because I know a lot of you are watching this on your mobile device. At the very bottom, there's a thing that says, turn on your notifications, so do it now. Turn on your notifications, and if you're on my YouTube channel or my podcast, like, comment, subscribe, share, get this out to other people, because this information is powerful. A few weeks ago, I made a video that 75% of your time, 75% of your time should be focused on two things, sales and marketing. Creating this network of fans of people that think you are the guy to real estate, number one. Number two is having conversations with them to set up appointments, give presentations, get contracts signed, negotiate offers, and get the money rolling in. If you don't have cash flowing into your business, you dying in your business, true or true, right? So we know a lot of our time should be focused on the sales aspect of it. However, how should we spend our money when it comes to marketing? Here's what I see a lot of you guys doing. And this actually stemmed up because someone messaged me about sending a $20 box of brownies to a pre-approved qualified listing appointment and said if you're going on five of those a week, then you're losing $100, right? And I started to think about it, no, you're not losing money, right? And what I realized is a lot of you guys have this thought process that expenses are losing you money, man. but there's a reason why. There's a reason why is because most people and most coaches and most trainers and most people out there, how do you spend your money on targeting cold leads, targeting these people that don't even know who you are to opt into your website, and this costs thousands and thousands of dollars. And so, it, yeah, very clearly, if you set an appointment with a for sale by owner and send them a $20 box of brownies, there's a good chance you're gonna lose out on that money, right? But if you get a referral or a past client, let me give you an example, I just recently set an appointment with some past clients, and we sent out something ahead of time, such as brownies, that they are, were excited, and were coming out to meet with you, right? And they get that, and, and they receive that, How what do you think that's gonna help our chances of actually getting that listing contract signed? And number one, it's a referral, past client. Number two is we're giving them appreciation. So if we're gonna spend our marketing dollars, let's spend it in the right areas. Here's the areas that I suggest that you spend your money, especially when it comes to marketing. So the number one key thing that I believe is to build my entire outcome for my business, and I recommend and have you consider the same as well, is to build it around having an amazing customer experience. Are brownies part of a great customer experience? Absolutely. Are client appreciation events part of a great customer experience? Absolutely. Is amazing communication during the process of their file an amazing experience? Absolutely. So number one is begin to reinvest your marketing dollars back into your past clients, your sphere of influence, your friends, your fans, the people that have supported you as you've created your business. Why wouldn't you, right? Number two is, is begin to invest in leveraging yourself to have individuals, talented, really cool, great working people that are as driven and excited to build the business as you are, that will help you give your customers an amazing customer experience. So those are the two areas that you gotta focus on. Reinvest into your customers. Give them an amazing experience. This is the number one absolute best way to invest your money. So let me give you an example. If you're spending $2,000 a month on generating online leads and you're not spending $2,000 a month reinvesting into your clients, well then stop investing online leads and start investing in giving your customers an amazing experience. Because I can tell you right now, for 2,000 bucks you can hire a rock star assistant that is going to be able to help you create an even better experience. And if they have even better experiences, how many referrals are you going to be able to generate from the people that know you, like you, love you, and trust you? That would be my challenge for you today. Thank you for everyone that's part of the Fearless Agent Nation. We love you. Appreciate you. Make sure you go and put down below live if you're a live watcher or if you're one of the replayers. And also make sure to go over uh, to fearlessagent.com if you're not on Fearless Agent. Go get on the free webinar. Uh, it's 45 minutes. It teaches you five presentations you got to know in order to be extremely successful in your real estate sales business. And get to know Bob Leffler, 480-385-8810. Go join Fearless Agent. We'll see you later.